Hi, welcome back to This Week in Trans. I'm Amy Fox from The Switch. No, that... You got it right. Our main story this week is on freedom of speech, but first, the news. United Airlines, known for breaking guitars, assaulting elderly doctors, subjecting passengers to weird rants about Hillary Clinton, regulating women's attire, calling the cops on gay parents for child molestation, calling the cops on mixed-race parents for child trafficking. Fun fact, they also fly planes. Well, now they have a former pilot who tried to consensually remove a trans woman's testicles. Then she wound up in the hospital after nearly bleeding to death. The funny thing about this is that removing testicles is not a complicated process. We do it to cows and horses every day. It's not rocket science or aircraft piloting. In an unrelated story, United Airlines tickets are unusually cheap right now. But for our trans woman viewers, just know, sorry, you still don't get a free orchiectomy with a ticket. Not yet. United. Do you dare? The government-owned railway system in Kerala State, India, is hiring 23 trans people as railway staffers. This follows on a ruling that, like many other marginalized groups in India, trans people can be subject to special hiring and training programs, and should be. Again, in Kerala State, where all this cool stuff seems to be happening. Go India! In the United States, two cadets are finding out the hard way that you can come out as trans and continue training for years to be an officer. And you can come out as trans and continue to be an officer, but you cannot come out in trans as training to be an officer and then become an officer. Catch 22. Read it. It's very relevant to the trans experience. And many other things. The US Armed Forces. Be all you can be. Unless that's trans sometimes. It's complicated. That's it for This Week in Trans. I'm Amy Fox from The Switch with the correct graphic. Yes! Remember to like and subscribe. Comment below, put in your questions, uh, flame war, whatever you like, it's all good to YouTube. Keep it queer.